All right, this is the first one of the day. It's elk stew. And it was made by this uh, young lady here and her husband. Now, what is this that you got here? Uh, Shedhorn pie. Shepherd pie? Shedhorn. Oh, Shedhorn pie. It's, shepherd, it's like shepherd pie, but we're calling it Shedhorn pie. And what's it made of? It's made of elk. <laughs> Uh, raw mashed potatoes, got green beans, carrots, peas, diced green chilies. I, got, I can tell you it is good. Thanks. And uh, he's enjoying some of that elk you know, stew right now. That's Todd Connor. Oh, no. Famous artist. And next to him is Cheryl Gold. Cheryl Gold. Famous Show us your card. A, a, a famous dog painter. She has portraits of, of dogs. Yeah. We call them puppums. And this is who? This is KT. Hi, KT. KT. She doesn't want to be filmed. She doesn't want to be filmed. And Jim Parsons, local chiropractor, mountain man. And whatever. Giving away, uh, I don't know what they're, oh, $1,500 uh, gift card. And they all oh, across the street, the fire department is giving away a gun. Now, what is this again? This is Montana cheese steak. So this is our version of the Philly. It's ground Madison Valley elk with sautéed peppers and onions served over a little piece of bread for the pure experience of a real cheese steak. Could you give me one without the bread, though? I sure can. I'll take the bread. You'll, there's some bread for you. Do you need it? And there's a fork at the end of the table if you need. Right. Thank you. There you are. And we're number 28 on the ballot, so we're on a non-chili. I think that's a good sign. Yeah, that's a really good sign. I'm excited. You can't go wrong with melted cheese, right? Yes. And there's forks at the end of the table. <laughs> yep, you've got your bread right in there. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> Smoked deer sausage gumbo with okra. Now this guy is from Yarlin. Yarlin. One word. Yeah. <laughs> wow. It looks good. It Smells is. good too. Okay. Winning numbers on the side of your cup. That gumbo is dynamite. Mm -hmm. It is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> Can you, uh, How you doing? Bring him to the studio. I haven't well, seen you for ages. Yeah, I haven't seen you either. Well, what do you want to do on that? Well, well hello there. Well, hi. How, how are you, David? Say hi to your daughter. Did you? Huh? What? Say hi to your daughter. She oh, might be watching my oh. YouTube show. Hi, Jackie. <laughs> I wish she'd call me. Yeah. <laughs> Now what is this? This is elk burger, buying different kinds of beans with a sweet sauce. Wow. Looks, looks dynamite. This is elk burger. What is it? Elk burger and nine beans with uh, got brown sugar and mustard and ketchup. And this is so, so amazing. No, that's Oh, good. No, it's wonderful. You should try it. <laughs> now, what is this one? Elk chili. Elk chili. Oh. Uh, cheese over here if you want some cheese. Oh, that's good. Oh. That really tastes great. That's good, isn't it? Perfect spiciness. That really is good. Boy, that looks good. That's the uh, elk chili with sour cream and peas. Whatever you got. So how's the chili? This is a milder chili. Yeah. Very delicious. 
I don't like it so hot that all you taste is fire. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me what I'm looking at. Yeah, so this is a back foot of a, a black bear, and you can tell not all black bears are black. So this is a brown, and that cub over there is actually another black bear cub. They come in cinnamon in this area, Montana, southwest Montana, about half the bears are that cinnamon or brown color. Yeah. Um, we think it's to do, actually due to habitat, like the, they live in more open areas than like say the oh. black bears back east where it's darker forest. Um, but sometimes you'll see real black bears. Yeah, yeah. You That's a grizzly yeah. bear right there. Yeah, this one's uh, uh, from Alaska. So our, oh, our wow. grizzlies don't get this big so here. <laughs> yeah, and they're actually the same species, but people call them regionally, call them different yeah. things. Yeah. They so, so big. yeah, exactly. And this salmon. This is the back foot of a grizzly. This is the back foot of a black bear. That's the back foot of a grizzly. Yeah, this is a grizzly. I'll show you the front foot. So, okay. Um, and that's about as big as they get? Uh, no, they get bigger than this. This is a medium sized grizzly big bear. Enough. Yeah, big enough, exactly. A small, but it doesn't and have to claw, be a big grizzly. <laughs> wow. Yeah, but you can see the difference in the claws. Like if you're out on the trail and trying to ID the two species, the claws are short and sharp on the black bear, long on the grizzly. Yeah, and the best the best way, if you've never heard this before, the best way to tell the two species apart um, is taking a straight line across the pad between the outer toes, the bottom of the outer toes. And in grizzly bears, it barely crosses the center pad, like the, this big pad. See how it's just yeah, pretty straight across, essentially. And with the black bear, if you do the same it goes, test, oh, it, goes it crosses that wow. pad. I have something for you guys. Do you you have to come back. We will. But you can't carry it around. Well, I got to get this door. You don't want to lose it. Do what you have to do. She's got uh, what she sprays into the uh, chili that she makes. She was picking up the stuff from the uh, store. To make. What is this? What is this now? This is my tequila elf chili. She, she sprays a little tequila in it. That's yours. Thank you. What? <laughs> Look, the musicians here. Okay. You guys have a regular line. There you go. Oh, yeah, man. Well, we go through the chase and everything. All right. I don't think she really needs a tequila to make it better, but boy, it doesn't hurt. But it's, tequila's healthy. Number one is our number. Number one on the chili list when you oh. want to oh. 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 <laughs> Is that good? That's good. Here, come here, you can't squirt in the mouth. No, no, no. <laughs> Okay. Oh my gosh, that's good. Always my favorite. Hey, Mike and Linda own the uh, Maydak Gallery here in Ennis, and uh, he's quite an artist. That's uh, one of his paintings. Uh, there we go. That's one of uh, Mike's paintings. Give it to you. Now here's a go owner that uh, of a store that dresses up in her pajamas to work in. I, wait a minute, let me see the bottom. Happy camper. This is the Leanne. Only time I'm ever gonna let you check out my butt. Yeah, this is Leanne Combs. And who who are you? Alicia. Alicia, and uh, this is her store which she's closing. But it's pajama day, so yeah. we wear pajamas. Anyway, I just bought about five shirts from uh, Leanne. She's going out of business. She is? Yeah, she's quitting out. She's selling the building. <clears throat> so, what is this one? Venice and White Curry. Oh, Venice and White Curry. Okay. <sighs> This is the only park in Black and Right? <laughs> Sorry, Dave, go ahead. Hey, David. How you doing? Good, how are you? Hi. Hey, how are you? How are you doing? Good. Is there any ice cream left? Yeah, we got tons of moose tracks. And then if you want to go to the I like it if you run to the park. Right? Okay. Looks good by you. I remember coming around our neighborhood when I was a kid. I have a 
um, elk backstrap with a coffee and ancho chili rub on it. Oh, and really? Smoked gouda mashed potatoes and blackberry plum um, ghost chili reduction sauce. Wow. Say that five times fast. <laughs> yeah, say that about 500 times. Oh, no, it's about 150 already. <laughs> Thank you. I don't like it, man. <laughs> wow, that's beautiful. There we go. Let's see what it tastes like. White tails chili. White tail chili. Did I got one already? Who cooked yeah. it? Could you have I a spoon? Is it cooked? <laughs> I want to try this. See you over the dollar? You gonna go out and bang anything? Or you don't care I'm gonna try it. Yeah. Mm. Oh no, it's, this is the meat I'm gonna bang. I gotta tell you that. It's got the best flavor. All right, I'm gonna call it quits for today. It's starting to get stormy. That's the hunter's feed for 2016. And got me a few shirts, cookies and had some great food on the street. See you next year, hopefully.